What's up, my Fina loves? It's Miss Fina D, and you're watching Fina Team and News. Hey, I'm just doing this. And we're going to video. Come on, PJ. Just take one picture. Just one. 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 Rest and relaxation. Just a little R and R. <laughs> oh, okay. That <laughs> poor said, "Now look, lady, we are on vacation." Can you put the phone down and let us enjoy this vacation? You are seeking validation from social media and wanting to prove, look at my life. I don't care what you all have to say. I want, look at how I'm living. And you will see those comments from her fans later, okay? I'm not the one saying these things. I have social media reaction. But Bulari is like, get that camera out of my face, girl, and all of these pictures and smile and do all of this. Let me live my life. <laughs> Bula is a typical child, okay? She's like, girl, mm -mm. same thing during the wedding. Good, right here, Smile, right here. baby. Good, right here, Smile, good. Smile, cheese. Good, look at right here, good, good. Good, that's perfect. Good. Okay, now serious face, sir. Sir. Oh, Portia and her girls. Good, that's perfect, perfect. Good. Yeah! I'm a mommy. Hello, oh my gosh. Like, if y'all don't get all these jewelry off of me, who are these people over here? <laughs> I just want to lay down and be a kid. But, yeah, she's adorable. And I call her Precious Speed. She's precious. But, yeah, like, girl, why we have to run down this hill with a camera in our face? <laughs> she's funny. Now, let's get into the part where Portia Williams fans are asking her if she's truly happy or if she's desperately posting two or three times a day and posting everything because she's seeking validation or trying to prove look at my life yes my character and my reputation might have taken a hit but was it worth it yes because of the narrative that i'm putting out there i mean look at my life look at these pictures i'm traveling i'm just setting I'm living, so I don't care what you have to say. Say what you want about me, but did I win? Yes. So some of her supporters feel like she's desperately trying to prove a point and that these posts and images and constantly having to post everything she's doing is not coming from a genuine place. But I'm like, okay, I get it. She's posting sometimes three to four times a day, but it's two seconds here, three seconds there. It's 24 hours in a day. She's not posting everything, but I understand it's social media. And of course, once you put your life out there, people will talk. And that's just what's going on. Not only pictures and little videos here and there were posted, okay? Portia also hopped on Instagram Live with her cousin Storm, the same cousin who allegedly said that Dennis sexually assaulted her. You all remember all of the videos I did on Portia Williams' show at the end of the season. Most of you are aware that I did not watch the entire season, but at the end of the season, when the fighting and everything was going on, and people were like, you know how Portia is always blaming other people for her actions? Well, she no longer have Kenya Moore and the Real Housewives of Atlanta 
to blame and she's over there on her own show fighting so i said okay let me give the last few episodes a try and this was the cousin who basically said all of those disgusting things about her ex-fiance but the father of her child and of course dennis denied everything storm stories weren't matching certain things that she was saying she did not press charges Dennis did not press charges either, so I guess we will never know because I would never go down that road and point fingers and say, well, you're lying. You're like, nope, I'm staying away from all of that. I'm just reminding you all who she is, the lady in the video. They were blasting music. They were at an outdoor party. So that's the reason why what they're saying doesn't matter because there's copyrights to music in the background. And normally when I post Portia Williams on Instagram Live talking anyways, most of you are like, Vina, I love you and I support you, but oh, I can't stand listening <laughs> to Portia. So it's not going to matter anyways if you can hear her voice or not. Portia is now hanging out again with this same cousin that said all of those things about Dennis. Now, I'm not sure if her show is coming back, if Bravo is going to give another season. And that's why her cousin is down there. No word yet. But we shall see. Now let's finally get to the parts that led to one of the comments I had on the screen earlier. Basically, the person wrote that Portia was trying too hard, like, you know, she was trying to prove something. So let's get into those comments. Do I care? No. But when a story is interesting, I will always cover it because I do stories on all of the ladies from the Real Housewives of Atlanta, regardless if they are currently holding a peach or not i just posted a video on nene leaks she's no longer on the show i posted a video with cynthia bailey i post videos about them all the time so let's go ahead and talk about Porsche real quick the name of the artist and the song title and also some lyrics from the song bounce your shoulder feel the vibe i am stressing today Peace and love is on my mind. I ain't stressing the day. Negative, well, I ain't got time. I ain't stressing the day. Just a few of the words, okay? There's a dance that went viral. Basically, you bounce your shoulder to this song. First person I saw doing this was Lupita. Stunning Lupita dancing to this song, bouncing her shoulder. And what happens is, as you're bouncing your shoulder, it shows you in different places, okay? So, Portia Williams decided to join in on the dance challenge. This was her video. She really wanted that girl life. <laughs> they rented home in Costa Rica, allegedly. This is where Portia was doing her dance. So, you know, no big deal. Portia's having fun, you know. She's proving the social media. Look at me. I'm living the life I've always wanted. My reputation might have taken a hit based on how this man and I got together. But I want you all to know it was worth it based on these images and pictures and this lifestyle that I'm living. This is a lifestyle that Portia could have provided herself, okay? So she wants to prove a point that in the end, I won. Look at my life. Regardless of how you feel I went about it, I won. So that's the validation that she's looking for. That's how some of her supporters feel based on these comments. So let's get into it. You try too hard. You sure you're happy? Yeah, it's giving, let me keep posting like I'm having the time. I am thinking the same way. Exactly. That or she's bitter as at somebody. Honey, you married now. Sit down somewhere. We see you. She living her best life after she done stole that lady husband. But never forget how you got the dude. Sometimes it's how you lose him. So her days are numbered. Not trying to be a hitter, but karma is a mother. And I know that's been the saying for years, but I mean, you can't steal somebody from someone else, okay? So, okay, so just because you're married doesn't mean you can't have fun, you can't post videos, you can't travel, you can't do your thing, okay? I think people are just saying, Portia posts every single day. And absolutely, that's Portia's life. That's what social media is there for. Portia is also a social media influencer, okay? Portia can do whatever she wants to do. And the thing about Instagram especially, it's so easy. If you don't want to see somebody, you don't want to see their page, if you feel like they're not genuine and their post doesn't come off as, I'm so grateful for this life, God, thank you. 
but it's more like look at me let me throw it in your face look at my life now me 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 pick me whatever you can simply hit that block button and you don't ever have to see that person page again i mean life is so simple there's no need to complicate it if porsche constantly posting every single day and look at my life hey i'm over here i'm enjoying life i want to prove it to you that's how you feel just block her <laughs> and you wouldn't have to see her page anymore but let me go ahead and read more of these comments from her supporters i just feel like the posts are not genuine and it's basically throwing things in people's face the same way you got him, you will lose him. So stop playing before you be crying again, girl. You look good though. Because said Portia is simply just living her life and nothing to see here. And I feel the same way, nothing to see here. However, I stand by what I said earlier. Portia is in the headspace of, I was dragged. My character is now forever questionable. And there's all of these negative things that people have to say about me. Now ask yourself, was it worth it? Well, based on these images, these videos, these private jets, and what I'm posting on social media and the narrative that I want to control, yes, it was worth it. And absolutely, there's more to life than material things. And as long as Portia is happy, but if material things also adds to Portia happiness, then that's why I'm saying to her, everything she went through was worth it and also i keep talking about seeking validation when you are someone who feeds of public opinion and validation then you create this narrative of perfection so someone like that is never going to tarnish the reputation unless it's beneficial to them so Portia is not going to do all of that to herself after going through her redemption season of you know black lives matter and i'm an activist and all of that just to throw it all away so trust and believe like i've been saying unless simon publicly does something so bad to embarrass portia or he just flat out just leave portia and simon will be together for a very long time anyways i'm wishing all of you well and take care LS, thank you all for your love and support. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up. Also, turn on notifications so when I do post, you're aware that I post it. And I will see you all in the comment section. Remember to always have the God bless attitude, which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation. Have a great day, guys. God bless.